The College of Telecom and Information. By Endeavor, we reached the pinnacle, a non-stop hard work and mastery which does not believe in else but pioneering. On the 1st of Ramadan 1388 Hijrah, the journey has started. Here was the beginning, where the journey began at the Institute of Communications, which was established and given its name after the royal approval to be affiliated to the Ministry of Post, Telegraph and Telephone. Day after day, we keep going on with firm steps and deep insight. In 1393 Hijrah, the Institute celebrated the graduation of its first class of 20 trainees. And in 1412 Hijra, the Institute of Communications moved a quantum leap and became a specialized college in the communications technology. In 1418 Hijra, the Council of Ministers issued its decision to conjoin the college to the Technical and Vocational Training Corporation, changing its name to the College of Telecom and Information. This was the beginning of going global. Global partnerships, technical alliances, are the achievements that rolled into the college. Training and development are terms that are closely associated with the College of Communications and Information. This policy generated excellence. We aim to rehabilitate and develop the national manpower in technical and professional fields according to the quantitative and qualitative demand of the labor market. We build strategic partnerships with businesses to implement technical and vocational training programs. And we expand in the advanced training fields that support national plans and participate in technology implementation programs. The training system at the college. Training modules at the college are to be taken in six semesters, including a semester for cooperative training. After completing the program, the trainee obtains a diploma degree. College departments. A lifelong process. It reached three departments with many specialties. The Department of Communication. Technicians graduate from this department and they participate in the installation and management of communication systems. They are qualified to operate and maintain such systems. To achieve this objective, the department has training equipment and specialized human resources that assist the trainee to obtain varied skills in analog and digital communications technology, transmission lines and fiber optics, antennas and propagation, data transmission networks, microwave technologies, and mobile communication. This department also includes a communications club equipped with the necessary equipment to help trainees to implement their projects and innovations. The Department of Computer and Information, which includes three very important specializations in the labor market, namely Network Technology. It aims to graduate specialists in the field of installing and configuring networks, Network Systems Management. It aims to graduate specialists in the management of users' accounts and Network Systems files, in addition to developing their skills in planning systems and programs and providing technical support. Software Specialization This specialization gives the trainee a broad background and practical skills in software technology and the Internet. Technical Department of Handicaps Willpower and the Bright Sun of Humanity casted its light on the College of Communications and Information in 1425 Hijra marking a leading national humanitarian initiative. The college is the first educational institute that gives the opportunity for people with disabilities, that's to say, the deaf and blind, to continue their higher education studies, just like other members of society, and graduate with a diploma in office applications. College facilities. The e-training and training resources center provides electronic systems interactive courses, and digital resources through partnerships and contracts signed by the main center in the Technical and Vocational Training Corporation. In order to achieve the optimal use of ICT in the training process, the process of development and expansion is continuous in the College of Communications and Information through supporting departments such as the Department of Cooperative Training, which coordinates the training of trainees in the business sector during the last semester of training. 
the Admission and Registration Department, which serves the trainees since admission to graduation in cooperation with the Department of Guidance and Counseling, which contains an activity center with varied types of entertainment and recreation. It provides the appropriate sports, social, and educational environment for the trainees. Another supporting department is the Alumni Department. It is responsible for following up trainees who are expected to graduate during and after the last semester in the college and after graduation. It also has a complete database of college graduates. The College Library The library offers a number of services, including loan of books and audiovisual materials, a broadband internet lab, printing and photocopying, daily newspapers and magazines, a special hall for quiet studying, which contains 20 separate study cells, and a reading hall. In continuation of beneficial partnerships, the Community Service Center was established. It provides the following services, specialized training programs in the fields of communications and IT, special programs for other organizations according to their needs, and delivered at their locations. Preparation and implementation of diplomas to many civilian and military sectors. Believing in the need to qualify our graduates for the future, the college has signed a number of agreements with several well-known corporations in the information and communications technology, including Oracle, Microsoft, Lucent, Ericsson, Saudi Telecom, and IBM, for training on the latest products and technologies of those corporations. College has signed an agreement with Cisco, the leading company in computer networks, as the first regional academy for Cisco systems in Saudi Arabia and the second academy in the Arab world. Trainees in our college become members of the local Cisco Networking Academy automatically once they are accepted in the network technology specialization. The college contains a testing center approved by the Pearson View organization to obtain global professional certificates such as CCNA, CCNP, Oracle, and others. The College of Telecom and Information. Training with competence. Performance with quality.